everyone thank you so much for stopping by so for today's video we're going to be doing a boxycharm unboxing this is not a try on this is only an unboxing but for this month i got the boxy lux i know this video is going to be going up very very late but either way i just figured i would show you guys the boxy lux box just so that you can kind of get an idea if it's worth it for you um if you've been getting the boxycharm regular and you've been thinking about getting the boxy lux maybe this will give you a good idea whether it's worth it or not. I'll give you my final thoughts at the end of the video, what I think of the box, but this is pretty much a $21.99 monthly subscription for BoxyCharm. However, if you're gonna get the Boxy Lux, it's an extra $30, like $29.99, something like that. And it comes out to like $50 for the Boxy Lux, but you get about $300 worth of product, I believe. But for this month, um, I'm gonna show you what I got. This is the second time second time second time that i get the boxy looks and again i will give you my final videos at the end but let's go ahead and get started and i'll show you what i got in my box so this is what the box looks like it is obviously bigger than your boxy charm because it does come with more products and it comes with your little pamphlet right here which will tell you what you get in your box and this is what the pamphlet looks like right here and it comes with like a little description of each item first item that i see here is the I don't know how to say this brand. I got it a few boxes ago. You know, I have no idea how you say it. It's the Pit Travel Hair Dryer. And it's super cute. As you guys can see, the color is very beautiful. And um, it's a little travel air dryer. However, if I travel, to be honest, I'm probably not going to be blow drying my hair. I'll probably just like either take it straight, then wear it curly. But if it's something that... I guess suits you and it's something that you like this would be a good thing to have it comes with a little pouch right here and then it comes with a little diffuser right here which i thought it was cute and then it comes with this little attachment right here i don't know what it's called but let me give you a little more information about that one so that one's a pit mini turbo on the go dryer and that one retails for 85 dollars up next we have this um tres trestic the good vibes mascara and i haven't even tried anything in the box i got it looked at it and i literally just set it to the side flip down to curl oh so it's a curling wand i don't understand oh okay okay so it's a i probably should read what it says but anyways it's a curling wand but then it also comes with a mascara so it looks like it's like a natural bristle kind of wand hmm. not bad when i saw this i thought it was just a curling wand and then you kind of clip it back on hmm that's interesting i've never heard anybody talk about this one so um, so this is the Tristique Good Vibes Mascara. It says treat your lashes to the ultimate curling, lengthening, and volumizing fun with your new Tristique uh, Good Vibes Mascara. This all-in-one lash curler tool and lash enhancing mascara gives you everything you need to take your lashes to the next level. And this one retails for $25, which is actually pretty cheap considering it comes with a little wand. Um, so I'm excited to try this. Never heard of this brand. Never heard anyone talk about this mascara. So that's exciting. Then we got this biotic balancing complex clean biotic bh balance yogurt cleanser i don't know if i want to open it doesn't smell like anything it looks like it's more of like that milky kind of consistency dr brandt clean biotic ph balance yogurt cleanser with chloro chlorophyll and it says powered by biotic balancing complex this pro prebiotic prebiotic Multitasking cleanser, yogurt melts away grime, makeup, and excess oil for skin that is hydrated and never stripped. Let the plants do the dirty work. This one retails for $35, so I'm excited to try this. Um, I love trying out cleansers, especially for like dry skin, things that kind of hydrate the skin, so I'm excited to have this one. Okay, then we have the Skin & Co. Truffle Therapy, and it's a Radiant Dew Mist. Truffle Therapy Radiant Dew is a hydrating mist formulated to soothe, protect, and illuminate the skin. Our glow-inducing tonic is inspired by the Italian legend of St. John's Water, a magical dew produced using flowers and herbs during the summer solstice, enriched with antioxidant-rich, soothing, and detoxifying botanicals such as black winter truffle, 
rosemary, ginger, peppermint, and damascena rose. This refreshing mist encourages a radiant complexion while rebalancing skin, pH level, tightening pores, and setting makeup. This one retails for $35. Wow. Spray feels nice. I'm going to let it dry and see what it looks like. Then we have this Tardis Pro Glow number no. 3. And this is the cheek palette. So it comes with blushes, highlighters, and bronzers it looks like. And then it comes with the mirrors that are right here. And you can kind of fold it back and use it like so. And this is what the outside looks like. It's super sleek. The thing with this one, honestly, is I don't really use blushes. So I don't typically go for palettes like this oh there we go you can kind of see it they're pretty they're really nice highlights and the bronzers on the top look pretty nice too not bad maybe i'll actually use these let me swatch the blushes too sorry those blushes are horrible but that's one of the blushes and over here they're super pinky so i don't wear blushes but if i wanted to it's not definitely the shade that I would go for. So the highlight's are really pretty. The bronzers are not bad. So I would maybe use this palette for those four, but definitely not the blushes. So we'll see if I keep it. And it retails for $45. And it's the Amazonian clay formula. Um, it's supposed to deliver streak and fade free flawless wear. The next four items that I'm going to show you are the ones that I'm mostly excited about. Those are the ones that when I saw that I got them, I might have squealed a little bit. The first one is the Full Dry Volume Blast by Living Proof. It's a styling and finishing spray. It's the Full Dry Volume Blast. Make some room on your vanity for your new Living Proof Full Dry Volume Blast. This styling spray creates instant volume and texture that's almost as light as air for big lasting results on dry hair. It offers UV protection. It's silicone free and safe for colored and chemically treated hair and it retails for $29. Let's try it out. Hopefully I don't mess up my nice and clean hair. Oh, that smell. Oh, wow. That smells really nice. Let's see. I'll put some here. I'm going to put some here. I'm going to put some back here. Oh, no, this is too tossable. The volume. Did it do anything? Mm. I mean, it smells good. Wow, that smells really good. I don't know. I don't know if I made a difference. I don't know if I put enough, but this smells. Oh, this smells so good. I'm not gonna lie. I might put this in my hair just for the smell because I want to smell like this forever. Oh my gosh. If you guys got this, Tell me what you guys think because this is what I want my hair to smell like forever. Honestly, if I run out of this, I might repurchase it just for the smell. Just so I can smell like this. Up next we have the No Pro No Par Problem 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 Prime Essence. And this is the Calendula Official Power Extract. Oh, also, that spray already dried on my hand and it does not look dewy. So this is what it looks like right here. It's definitely watery. So you guys can see right there. It's very runny. This is what it looks like right there. It's like a clear consistency kind of thing. This is the Touch and Soul No Problem Primer. Let your makeup stay a while with your new Touch and Soul No Problem Prime Essence infused with Calendula Offic Officinale, Officinale Flower. I don't know. Extracts this primer tightens up your pores, keeping your skin silky and smooth. And it retails for $23. Not bad. I really like this brand. I enjoy their product, so I'm excited to have this one and try it out. This one was one that I was so excited to get. This is the Pharmacy Honeymoon Glow. I've had this in my cart for Sephora on Sephora site forever, but it's expensive, so I didn't want to buy it yet. But when I saw that it was coming in here, I nearly cried. It's an AHA resurfacing night serum with hydrating honey and gentle flower acids. This one, Kathleen Lanks raved about for a while. She said that she was using it. She could tell that it was giving her a glow, which is why I put it in my Sephora cart. But again, it's pricey, so it's not one that I bought right away. So when I saw that it was coming in here on one of the sneak peeks, 
honestly is the one reason that I was excited about this box. Like, that's it. This is all I wanted. This is the Pharmacy Honeymoon Glow AHA Resurfacing Night Serum. It's a 3-in-1 night serum that resurfaces, hydrates, and clarifies your dull skin while you sleep. Formulated with a 14% AHA, BHA Gentle Flower Acids Blend, you'll get a youthful look, smooth complexion, as the look of pores, fine lines, and wrinkles are reduced. And this one retails for $58. This made the box worth it for me. And I'm so excited to use it. I don't know how often you're supposed to use it. Uh, oh, okay, so it's used two to three times a week. So I'm excited to try this. I want to see if it works. But if it does, I might be a little sad because I don't know if I want to pay $58 for a new one. But I'm excited that this came in here so I can try it out and see if I like it. And then last but not least, we have the Dominique Cosmetics. This is the Lemonade Collection. Add hydrating shine and fullness to your lips with a lightweight, non-sticky balm like Lemonade Lip Gloss. Oh, it's a lip gloss. The sheer gloss is long-lasting and flexible so you can wear it alone or layered over a favorite lipstick. And this is $17. I totally thought this was a lipstick. Let's see. I already have a lipstick under. Oh, that shade is really pretty. It's a super sheer kind of lip um, gloss. So this is what it looks like right here. So it's super glossy. It makes my lips look very, very juicy. Mm. I love that it doesn't have any shimmer in it because I don't like glosses that have shimmer in it. I know a lot of people like them. I don't. I actually almost hate them because then when you wipe them off, it leaves back, like, leaves behind that little glitter flex and I don't like it. I don't know if I said, but this is in peach tea. So pretty. And it doesn't really feel sticky. It feels lightweight. It feels like a gloss. It feels like you're wearing it. But, mmm, I like it. This is the lip gloss right there. Look how pretty that is. It's like a peachy type of shade. Mmm, I'm excited to have this. Let me add up to tell you what everything is going to value to. It is $352. $352 and I only paid $50. <laughs> so at this point, it's honestly up to you if this is something that is worth it. For me, I honestly thought this was going to be the last time I got it. But I don't know. Every time I say it's going to be the last time I get it because I'm not excited, there's like a few items that kind of do it for me and end up getting it again. So for this month, I am definitely excited to have this lip gloss right here, the Dominique Cosmetics. I'm super excited that it's a lip gloss. I'm excited to try this No Problem um, primer because it looks super dewy and I feel like it's going to be really nice under your makeup. I'm excited to continue trying this because that smell is bomb. It's so good. I love how my hair smells right now. Like, I move and I smell myself. Oh, and I smell so good. So, and this one here. This one's the one that I'm mostly excited about. So, just between these four. This box is worth it for me. Let me know in the comments below what you guys got. If you guys got the boxy lux or if you're thinking about getting it next time, which will be in three months from now. And September is going to be the next boxy lux. If you want to sign up, you have to be a boxy charm subscriber to get this box. But let me know in the comments below what you thought of the products that I got. Let me know what you got and what you're excited to use. But other than that, that's going to be it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up. Also, if you haven't subscribed already, I would appreciate you to do so. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye. Thank you.